Hello, everybody. Happy Halloween. I've been in the Halloween spirit recently. I recently made a video about Halloween vocabulary. I realized that、um, it may be kind of difficult to pronounce some of these words. So I'm going to play the video for you and show you how to pronounce each word. So, what is this? It's a vampire. Vampire. Now, vampires drink people's blood, they are immortal, and there's a lot of movies and books about vampires. Number two, what is this? It's a haunted house. So, a haunted house is a house where maybe ghosts or spirits live, and you often see them in movies.、Um, they're called horror movies. Number three, what is this? It's called a Jack O' Lantern. So, in Halloween, we take a pumpkin and we carve a face or a picture into it, and then we put a candle in the middle, and it's called a Jack O' Lantern. Four, what is this? I think you know, I've already said it, I've already mentioned it. It's a ghost. Ghost. So we don't really pronounce the H, it's just a G. Ghost. Number five. Ah, what is this? She flies on a broomstick, she wears a pointy hat. She's often outside at nighttime during the full moon. It's a witch. And the male version of a witch is a wizard. So we have a wizard is a boy, a witch is a girl. What is this? It's a vegetable that is often ate during the autumn season. And it's called a pumpkin. Pumpkin. Do you like to make pumpkins? Sometimes I make pumpkin soup. Which is quite good. This one is a mask. M A S K. Mask. People wear masks on Halloween because it's part of the tradition that actually goes back thousands of years. People thought that if you wear a mask, it will keep away the spirits on, that come out on the night of Halloween. Number eight,、uh, this is a scary object that comes from ancient Egypt. It's called a mummy. Not like a mother. For a mother, it's an O, mummy, but this is a U. It's a dead person who has been wrapped in paper and usually put underground. Okay, well, this is a place. This place is called a graveyard. It's a graveyard. So, graveyards are creepy, spooky, scary places that we don't necessarily want to go to. Number 10. What comes out of the ground from a graveyard? There's a lot of movies and TV shows about this. It's a zombie. Zombies became much more popular in the culture in the past 10 or 20 years. I'm not sure why. Number 11. What do kids do on Halloween? They wear costumes and they go around the neighborhood and they are trick or treating. So, trick or treat. It's like we are going trick or treating. It could also be a verb. What are you doing? We are trick or treating right now. 12.、Um, this is the bones of a person. It's called a skeleton. There's no skin, there's no organs, just the bones. It's a skeleton. 13. 13 is an unlucky number. What is this? This is something that farmers use to keep away the birds. It's called a scarecrow. So they put this in the farm and then it scares the birds. So, the birds don't come and eat the vegetables. So, a crow is a kind of bird, so it's called a scarecrow. So, that's all of the words for Halloween. Let me read them one more time 
and repeat after me to practice your pronunciation. Vampire. Haunted house. Jack o' lantern. Ghost. Witch. Pumpkin. Mask. Mummy. Graveyard. Zombie. Trick or treat. Skeleton. Scarecrow. So let me know if you can think of any more spooky or scary vocabulary words for Halloween. And I hope you have a safe and happy Halloween and good luck studying English.